Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back once again to Shining Force, the legacy of great intention. We've just managed to clear the road on the way to Dragonia, and now it's time to continue our quest. Let's go into Dragonia. Okay, so we've got angsty battle music. Um, this seems to be some sort of shot by now. So, ooh, hello. Apparently, I don't know, I don't think I can even look at this. So, let's go explore this still. I'm hoping by the terms of the name of that, we're expecting uh, dragons. Halberds. Always good. Let's, um, who shall we give this to? Kent is always the best option, I believe. Uh, yep, it's a decent enough upgrade. So, let's just go exploring a little bit further. Ooh. So, lots left to do here, it seems. Don't need to go there because we're not changing anybody. What is this? Two heroes. Okay. Very good question. Where are all the dragons? Broadsword. Nice. Well, we're just going to keep that one there because we're going to be using it in middle battles, so I imagine that is going to be the most interesting thing to do. Doesn't seem to be anything in here, so let's go back to the room I was just in. And let's get down those stairs and see what's in there. I'm interested to see where it goes, where this story is headed now. It's um very interesting. Oh, okay, so it's just in this here. Hello. This person is our friend, he's here to help you stop shaking, you baby. <laughs> Karen, you're so mean. Interesting. Oh, wow. she's what, immediately got into trouble? There to me, don't care about what's going on, just immediately get to open chests because loot. And we are immediately going to give that to. a healer. Yeah, I'll give you an airy. That'll do. Right, let's see what's going on. What could be going on next? Always seems like there's trouble somewhere, but I wonder where exactly is it happening. <laughs> Just melted him. <laughs> oh, interesting. I don't know why we get sad music because he just rescued his friend. But, um, we have a dragon on the team. And, hell yeah. Fair enough. I am going back to... Okay. I'm going to go put a dragon on the team because that's what we do. 
Do we need to res anybody? This is a good question. I can't remember. Uh, yeah, sure, let's save. Okay, yep. Uh, is there anybody? You see, he keeps dying a lot. I don't know who we should replace, really. Uh, anybody else to raise? Everybody's alive. Alright, so let's go get a dragon on the team. Uh, join. A level 9 dragon. This is a good question. Who do we want to leave behind? We've got healers, we've got archers. See, Babaroi seems to be weak. And then, I assume, um, yeah, I assume we just talk to this dude that's randomly appeared. Cain of Rufhouse. Ready for your last fight? Okay. So I presume I just go down and back up and we begin. Wow. So we've got gargoyles, I believe, yeah. Golems, yeah. Priests, mages, yeah, we know what this does. Skull Knights and Kane, who has a sword of darkness and a broadsword. 70 hit points. Uh, is there anything else lurking around? No. Okay. Oh, I'm still poisoned. Fantastic. Uh, do I have a detox? No, I don't. At least it's going to be interesting. I've got to be really careful here. Who knows uh, where this is gonna go? This could be a really offensive team, it could be really defensive. And those gargoyles are coming straight in. Uh, does the halberd give me. No, it's a single target. And I missed. Uh, this is a side of things to come, isn't it? Let's do some damage. Pow. Alright, that's good. Come on. Uh, gotta be careful like golems and magic is gonna be the best thing to deal with them. Interesting that the gargoyles just went straight past the guys. Yeah. Wow, these guys are moving straight up with the action, aren't they? Um, this is interesting. I really don't know how to handle this. I'm hoping that that back end is going to be leashed hard so that they won't get into too much. They won't get too close, but we'll see. Broadsword that looks like a dagger. Oh, Max got in two hits, it's good. One day I'll remember to cleanse all that poison as well, because, ah, oh my goodness. Let's just 
deal with the gargoyle because we know if Luke gets a hit then it's dead. Which is good. Right, so that's dealt with those. So the question is, how do we deal with the next lot? Still keep ourselves alive. What magic have these guys got? Freeze two. Jeez, I need to start using my diamond formation. If I don't start using diamond formation, then there's a very good chance I'm going to get obliterated off the face of the planet. behind some of the other guys. But he's a dragon, so yeah. Right, well at least um, they seem to be leashed in front of that, so I'm not going to be dealing with like an army of an 11. Need to get Luke up. Interesting that they're not coming to engage. This could either be very good or very, very bad. I need to get this. I need to get this poison cleared as soon as possible because it's just going to end up leaving me with issues. I wonder if Kane is going to act like the other bosses that we've seen so far and magically heal himself and know what he's watching and just deal absurd amounts of damage. Should be interesting. These things are going to be defensive if I remember. Although 9 points of damage isn't too bad. I want to do is I want to kill these things because these have the potential of being absolutely horrible. Kill one of the mages off. That'll be the... That's the goal, to kill the mage. Because then I'm dealing with a lot less magic all of a sudden. Nice. Yeah, I get the feeling that is really not the best thing to do. Unfortunately, I don't think this is even because I'm in freeze territory from the other mage, but I need my heavy hitters up front to deal with the golems. And they can survive at least one freeze, I mean, that's the thing. Ow, that was a crit, that's not good, because he's my tanky character. Priest healed himself, which is always a bonus. Rather him heal himself than anybody else, especially when he's going to cast heal before and waste 20 magic points. 
AI is a bit dumb. <laughs> Let's put it that way. Get our tanky guy healed. This should inevitably help us a little bit. Alright, let's see how our dragon does. Okay. I was hoping for a little bit more personally, but that's a shame. But Max has gone up a bit, becomes that little bit more tanky. And that should deal with quite a bit of the golems. Got a crit as well. How nice is that? Brilliant. She's got a level. I didn't see what free spell that went up. The mage didn't cast. Well, that just became incredibly useful. Right, let's exterminate the priest. Let's hopefully annihilate this mage before he gets a chance to retaliate. Absolutely decimated. Brilliant stuff. One last golem to deal with. Yeah, I need some of my heavy hitters here in the back. everybody their scant experience while I can I guess. <laughs> it evaded. Brilliant. Brilliant stuff. Okay so that's the second wave done. I'll be honest I walked into this with... Uh, well when you see any type of boss monster you're going to be very apprehensive about what you can and cannot handle. So it's, um, especially since I fought and faced one a couple of episodes back, and um, perhaps it's magic words, and it pretty much decimated half my team. I'd be interested to see if you could actually um, do a no kill rock, like lose no party members, because I, I have run some of those in Shining Force 2. Because for some bizarre reason, it actually holds a um, death counter on each of your characters. So, it's interesting. But with these things hitting so hard, I'll be interested to see what happens. Sheriff Cure, I mean, if it's equivalent to healing rains in the later game, which I don't think it is, then what healing rain did was Aura 4, which is basically a cure 4, but for everybody on the party. So I'll be interested to see what Shower does. Just got to get it to a, a viable point that we are needed to use it, I think. Let's 
so how do we handle this? Let's just check what Anna we got. Did she get 3-3? Three, three? She did. Which is basically freeze 2 but with uh, an even bigger range. So I can cast it the same way that the archery can at 3 scares back. Which might be wise. You know, if I just if I just aim at sticking them under here and just use magic attacks to just weaken the forces. I'm not sure if this is suicide or bravery, we shall soon find out. That dealt with that easily enough. My problem is, is that I'm very, very close to who I don't want to be at. This is the point, this is where we see if he's gonna just... Ow. Wow, even if he was fully healed, he was not gonna survive that. Well, we killed the mage. That's something. I can't use it again though, since it's damaged. The fact that he just literally one shot one of my heavy hitters has really got me worried at now. This is now going to become an old pile on to the boss before we die. Damage Zylo, you used to be great. Why are you suddenly become super weak? at least. Yeah. Well, last freeze, but if we can take out the priest, that's the main thing. And I mean, magic does do a sheer amount of damage to that boss, which is very good. again. Although I imagine this is going to be slightly less damage, but it dealt with Dullahan, which is good. And we got a crit to do normal damage, oddly. Yeah, I imagine that was coming next. Uh, I don't really care at this point, so uh -oh, that's cursed. Basically, that has a very low percentage chance to do what it does, but if it does, it one hit KOs. It doesn't really matter how much health you've got. I can have 100 health on each of these people and it will just instantly kill them. It's it's one of those spells that's really rare if it works, but if it does work, then you're happy as hell. And it obviously has a 0% chance against bosses, etc. So, yeah, let's back off. That's uh, slightly disappointed. Let's just get some free experience going on some of the healers, I guess. It's 
not much, but um, 10 experience points is better than nothing. So I really shouldn't complain about that. Let's just keep it rolling. Show. You would have thought a dragon would be like super death warranted and just go, I'm gonna breathe fire on everything you do. Uh oh. I was hoping Guts I'd be able to bring in to do some serious heavy hit, but uh, apparently not. And you are pretty much useless. Okay, so we've got 20 damage to do. We know we can deal 6 damage with certain people. I think we've got this in the bag, really. If I hit with him, that is. Yeah, there's absolutely no point casting Freeze 2 at this point, so... This now just becomes, uh, I think this is a walkover. I think we I think I was a lot more scared of this battle than I actually thought. And in hindsight, ah, there we go. Good job, Kakiri. Kakichi. Brilliant stuff. My mask is breaking. He masked his face to control him. Okay. Okay, so we've got a mission to check the shrine. And it's at this point that I will bid you adieu, ladies and gentlemen, and I'll see you next time for more Shining Force, the legacy of great attention. <laughs>